another photo. I'll give you the links to this one too. Actually, it looks like his mouth has moved and his wing is spread out more on the rock. And this guy looks to be just the head maybe moved just a little. And this part of his wing maybe moved just a little. And also in this picture, see what they're hiding here. You see these carvings? And the carving back here. The computer manipulated this somehow. But you can see, I mean, these are these are some type of carvings. This is all, see how they took this out here? There was something very important here. All of this, see? This is all blurred. You could see part of it under here. They, you could see a little piece of the statue in here. See these car This is all a 3D carving. And they just put this I don't know, like greenish stuff over and it looks like it's a continuation of this rock, but it's not. How they would have left this in here is only, I just have no idea. I, I have no clue. I'm, I'm almost lost for words because this here was definitely manipulated. see this is some pretty cool carvings all right you see this cool carving that they've blurred in see how they did it it's pretty cool actually how they they can just make anything they want disappear Damn, they can even make humans disappear. <laughs> There's that thing that I, I'm calling some type of cockroach or water bug. Now, for some reason in this picture, it looks like NASA started to, the computer started to manipulate this thing. You see? How they put the blocking. See that? This is off of NASA's website. Normally, did we just boost the gamma a little? This is this is one of the easiest pictures I've really ever worked on. I gotta say, the most impressive and the easiest. But you could see that they just started blocking. Okay, and we'll also put the link to this one too. Now again, there's that little thing that I call a cockroach. This is a different picture. Now it looks like his head is bent up a little more. Like he's lifted. That's just my opinion on that one. But it's totally a different picture. This is no editing except I boosted the brightness or what a gamma brightness. Look at this cool thing. gone through every picture in this soul with a fine tooth comb and you know there's some cool stuff like this see these carvings but there is nothing more impressive than those animals in the rock. They did a little little work on it. There's at least to be some like type of rectangular thing there. Cool little I don't cry, I don't know what to call that thing, but you know, like I said, I've gone through these soles pretty pretty good. Almost every picture. And there's some strange stuff, but you know like little things like that. But those animals, man, that's 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 the deal. That's 
you know, when I first saw that, man, I ran that by a couple people I know. And that's the first thing that they said, worm and a giant fly. So, all right, I'll give you all the links to these pictures, as usual. And, uh, you know, make up your mind. What's funny is, is on NASA's website, this is one of the pictures of that outcrop. And at this time, now whether this picture, I'd have to look and see if it was taken before or after. I think it's after. That, that thing is gone. Now, did they edit this photo? To me, this area looks a little different. So, I, uh, you know, I, I don't want to, you know, I, I don't know. I, they might have edited this area, who knows. But that little alleyway, he's not there. I mean, he stands up pretty prominent and he's gone. And then in this picture, you can see the worm is still up there, but only one of his wings is showing, and it looks like half of his body's in there, he's moved. That's not the same. This thing is alive. And this is the picture, you can see it's the same picture, I'm not BSing anybody. That hole there was blocked. There was no light coming through there. So, I'll put all the links, you put the pieces together, you make up your own mind.